Hunt is underway in Morrisville for a suspect who shot a police officer. Schools are closed and people are being asked to stay indoors with the doors locked. Police are looking for this man, 24 year old Henry Lovell. He's considered armed and dangerous. Morristown police responded to a reported kidnapping and domestic disturbance involving Lovell last night at around 845 and police have not seen him now for four and a half hours. And this video is just into the Channel 3 newsroom. It was taken inside the VFW in Morrisville and the timestamp on the video says this happened at nine last night. It shows Lovell there in a red baseball cap and camouflage jacket. He struggles with another man over a long gun. The other man manages to wrestle it away. Lovell is seen then leaving the room. Melissa Cooney has been in the area all morning long. Melissa, where are you now and what should people know who live or work in that area? That's right, Darren. Right now I am here on Pleasant Street. This is right here in the street. And as you can see, there is police tape and the major crime unit has just arrived. Now, this is exactly where the domestic disturbance happened last night, where police responded to. And to my right over here is actually where the VFW is. So to get your bearings, this is where the domestic disturbance happened. And based on the video we received, the VFW is really just a few feet away. Now, this area, this entire scene is where the officer and the Morristown officer was shot. That's where the officer was treated at Copley Hospital and released. It's also important to note that the supervisory union here closed the Elmore School, the Morristown Elementary and People's Academy for the day. People in the area are asked to stay inside with the doors locked. Now, this morning, our cameras watch uh, VSP armored vehicles inspect a building just across the street. They were only there for a handful of minutes before they returned to the Morristown Safety Building. Residents and businesses are being asked to report any suspicious activity or possible sightings of Lovell. Police are looking for any surveillance video from the public to aid in the investigation. Many businesses are closed today, but one business is open around the area. We spoke with Power Play Sports, who one of the employees said that this is a very quiet area normally and not much disturbances are happening in this town generally. Now, we also saw a U.S. Border, border and Customs Patrol helicopter circling over the area. We actually saw it at the Bishop School just a few minutes um, ago down the road hovering over. That's where we are able to see. We don't have confirmation if this, you know, helicopter is associated with this search, but it has been circling the area for quite some time at this point. And once again, police say that they believe that level is armed and dangerous and right now the major crime unit is here and they've been investigating the scene for about an hour in person and there are dozens of law enforcement staging just down the road at the Morristown safety building. That's Vermont State Police, Morrisville uh, Police, Stowe Police and the Lamoille County Sheriff's Department. We will keep you live with updates throughout the entire day right here on Channel 3. For now we are live in Morristown. Melissa Cooney, Channel 3 this morning. Melissa, thank you. And again, the message to residents in that area, stay inside and lock your doors. Report anything to police that you appear to have information about this ongoing investigation. Breaking news to tell you about right now.